Scuttlemutts! Scuttlemutts. Hi, welcome back. We're talking about, uh... Mental energy. Yeah. And finding time to do things. Yeah, no, because we were talking about, like, new hobbies and stuff, but... And having it, like, not ruin your life. Um, well, between this and, like, work and stuff, and drinking, like, coffee and trying to keep your energy up, mm -hmm. I, I feel like I, I can't do much else, like, with my time. Yeah. Because I'm just tired, you know? I don't know if it's an age thing or just whatever, just being busy. It's it's hard to, like, try to do anything else, and I hate it. I want to be able to do more and not have to sleep ever. <laughs> no, yeah, I feel that. Because, uh, like, definitely, like, as human beings... You only have a certain amount of energy you can spend mentally, like, per day. Like, you can get it back by, like, relaxing, but that takes time. Yeah. So, and there's only so much time in the day. And when you have to, like, go to a job and stuff, that takes a huge amount of time. Pr presumably eight hours if you're full-time. Yeah. Uh, it probably takes a huge amount of mental energy as well. Um, I mean... Yeah, there's the trade-off, though, with the job is that, you know, you're getting financial security, you're getting something out of it. Well, I mean, yeah. I didn't say if it was enough or, or good, but... <laughs> <laughs> Dumbass. <laughs> but no. yeah, no, yeah. But with, like, hobbies and stuff, you're getting that kind of a different thing, you know, you're getting, like peace of mind or you, you know you're working on something you want to you feel accomplished when you're doing it which you might not necessarily get at work sometimes mm -hmm. it's but, a different kind of trade-off yeah but definitely different hobbies have different you know effects that's true it's like playing video games uh that's like a good way to de-stress um you know you, you're just having fun you're not necessarily like building a skill or anything but you're you're having a good time and you just let your mind be free for a bit. Mm. Um, but then hobbies where you're like trying to learn something, like they, you know, they can still be fun. But usually, if you're putting like that kind of effort in, yeah, then it does take a toll on you. And sometimes, even if you like really want to do more of it, you just can't always find the energy. Right. Yeah. And then you get mad, and then you're like, ah, I just, I'm not getting this one like thing down. Like if I was like I was doing trying to like. Do very basic like Ode to Joy today on the keyboard, and it was uh, mm -hmm. I just I, I kept missing like the last note, and I was starting to get frustrated. And yeah. I had to like go walk outside, <laughs> take no. a walk to kind of de stress. But you know what I mean? Like, because if, you know, I've worked all week and like I, I didn't go to sleep that early last night, as you know, mm -hmm. you can attest to as well. Like, when you don't get your right sleep, it just even your hobbies become like a nightmare. Yeah, it's especially <laughs> bad when it's like you don't have the energy to do them, but you really want to. Oh yeah, yeah. You know, I was super excited because I was like, because I've mentioned before, I was trying to like learn the bass, and I bought a bass, and I'm like, oh, this is hard, and I don't know anything about music, and I don't want to become like a jukebox where I just like play one song over and over again. Yeah. Even though I'd like to learn songs and stuff, I want to be able to like learn music as a whole. Well, you, you always... keyboard's kind of like a good starter instrument. I would agree with that. So I think I jumped the gun on that, but... <laughs> yeah. No, I mean, it's, it's good to branch out and try and learn new things. Mm. I do think it's also important to recognize, though, just what's possible. Because, like, um... I don't know, something for me is... I don't talk about this too much. Ah. Uh, but I've been trying to lose a lot of weight recently. Mm. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm a bit heavy. Um, and I've lost, like, I think 20 pounds over the last two months. Um, well, yeah, no, every t every couple times I talk to you, you're, you're making progress, you know, you're keeping track of it. Yeah. You know, it's noticeable, it's yeah, happening. Th well, thank you. But doing that is a lot of effort. Like, I'm, uh, oh, I extremely. Have to, yeah, I have to yeah. record every single thing I eat. I have to be very careful about what I put into my system. Mm. It's, you know, it, it just takes a lot of strength. Or not strength, but, like, well, energy. Um... Because, like, there's also some hobbies I would like to get into. I'm also trying to get back into music. Right. I used to play piano when I was much younger, but I haven't in years. Um, but, like, splitting my time between, you know, that and doing scuttlemutts and stuff, I think, um, I think I might, you know, try and make some more progress on, like, that journey of mine hmm. and then try and get back into it when I can, like, let up a little bit on watching myself. Right. It becomes when, a bit more natural. Right, when you, you get into, a, like, a routine with it where it kind of becomes second nature, which takes a long time for yeah. anything, you know? Mm -hmm. um, I, I would say, too, about the music thing, 
even though you know we're talking about it as a hobby, part of, part of the reason too I want to do it is because I want to kind of integrate it with Scuttlemutts a bit. Scuttlemutts, you know, because Scuttlemutts, the like, band. Well, I like our intro, but I figured that if we can make our own music and just you know the more self-sufficient we can become with this. Ew. Exactly. Oh, sorry. But real quick, ah! Jesus God! <laughs> what skull. the fuck? <laughs> My God! I knew they were ugly, but looking up close, Jesus, that's not. Ah! Oh. It's like a the pug of humans. Why is it, your head so big? What is it? What is it? Now, he Are looks you, like something that... He looks nutritionally deficient. How, how can no, you, look at that cheek How bone. is he a seated tennis player? He yeah, looks Jesus, I can only assume malnourished. that... <laughs> I can only assume that it's not from the strength. No, but from shit, the, I know what it is. they're so aerodynamic that from one. being only bones. <laughs> that's what I was going to say. He's so aerodynamic, that's why you can it's move. It's not the power of <laughs> their skill, it's science. They tried to beat us with science, but they couldn't. Because we have the power! The power of Tennis God! Ah! This is like all he has, and you took that away from him? Well, honestly... <laughs> That's the look on his look, face. Looking at his face now, I don't think he deserves it. I you don't think... He looks like he's... I don't think he's, like, awake. <laughs> it's like, uh... <laughs> you go to talk to him after the match, you're like, Good game! He shut he's off. Like, <laughs> he just doesn't respond. He tries to bite you! He's actually a zombie! A tennis zombie! <laughs> This is what the Empire has been reduced to. No, wait, I got it! He's a clone! He's a clone? They cloned him too oh, many times! fucked. <laughs> it's the DNA degeneration! Jesus All right, Christ. anyways, sweet, we did it. He needs a mushroom. <laughs> <laughs> Go oh, up a boy. level. <laughs> uh, and now uh. we've stolen his tennis skill. I assume that's what's happening, is we're just stealing the power of these players, like the Monstars. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, you sapped him up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Ultimate yeah. speed. <laughs> Ultimate speed. If you can go fast, you can go f even faster. <laughs> Congratulations. Oh, we yeah. To play Tough Emily shit next. because. Oh wow! Fucking. Uh, oh. Can we talk about how it's? What the fuck, yeah. Mark? You're representing <laughs> our school. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> He's like number one too, I think. Yeah, not anymore. <laughs> Beaten out by fucking Bird Boy. You're seated! <laughs> yeah. Uh, wait, Mark is Kubibara, right? I think so. Oh, you uh, did it, Oshie. You made semifinals. It's your first time here, but you still made the semifinals. I didn't, because I'm an idiot. Nice job, Oshie. You showed great out there in round two. Oh, man. Uh, since round two ended, we'll take a short break. Gather here before the start of semifinals. Okay, easy enough. But yeah, no, I think Mark's Capybara Boy. So I... I think he fucking lost. Let's, Let's take a short him. walk off a long pier. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> Which is just taking a short walk. Yeah, no, he's just talking about yeah. stuff. We need to leave and come back so we can talk to our rivals. We destroyed it. Where are you, Michael Jackson? Good talk. <laughs> he's not, he said like he did what you were saying. Yeah. Oh, God, he did. He can't <laughs> respond. Uh, so Mark lost his first match. He went... Wow. Guess the pressure got to me. Well, that's what happens when you have a stupid capybara head. It's not meant for pressure. Yeah, king of the rodents, more like, uh, s dumb. Yeah, <laughs> what you said. What does Cyclops have to say? <laughs> I never thought I'd lose, but I'll have my revenge for you, other X-Men character. I don't know anything about X-Men. Um, he, what is it about Cyclops? He and Wolverine don't get along. Doesn't he have a girlfriend? <sighs> I, Who's dead? I, what is that? No, yeah, so he was like with Jean Grey or something for a while, but then he cheats, on, he cheats on her with maybe Emma Frost? Yeah, the ice one. Yeah, well, she's diamonds. Fucking Bird Boy's confident. Yeah, she's not ice, she's diamonds. She's a telepath who can turn into diamonds. What? Yeah, she's, she's diamonds. This doesn't make any sense. It's X-Men. This is mutants. I don't like the way the diamonds. Beast Boy is saying Beast this over Boy? here. <laughs> Grr, Emily was good. I'm gonna go wild and be her next year. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh, he could do it. He's got the chin to do it. Yeah. <laughs> well, don't mind me. I'm just gonna get a soda. Uh, chink. Doot doot doot. Chink. Enjoy your cola. <laughs> yeah. Delicious, sweet, delicious cola. Uh. I sure do love a wolf cola before my tennis match. Oh, boy. Next time on Mario Tennis, it's always sunny in the island open. 
Bye. 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 <laughs> <laughs>